Yo, hey, what's up, guys? Yes, you see it right. We're gonna use the Gina to solo Emios, and I still can't believe it. Yannick, the myth, the legend, he came around and showed us a Gina doing it in three minutes, and I was so surprised. And yeah, obviously, I wanted to re record it because it's amazing and it can help out so many people. And yeah, it is super quick and everything, so. The requirements, we have to talk about it. It is high blessing, but I kind of assume if you have a Gnat and you kind of want to play him, you will aim, aim to get high blessings on him and everything should be okay for you. So the concept is we survive by having region gear and immortal gear while doing really, really hard hits. We also do have crit rate up, so everything is a little bit more easy to um, limit cap on the hits. And also the masteries are like, wait, I pressed the wrong button in the background, are like that. And yeah, <laughs> we can use Giant Slayer, we cannot use it, it does not matter because yeah, we will max HP hit anyway. So, <laughs> like guys, come on and keep in mind, you can still use a lead in here if you want to do something, you still can use... <laughs> If you want to do it, Spirit Haze to get more speed, you can use, increase your HPs and stuff in here. And I also want to say, if you want to do something like that and you only have one g -nut, that's totally okay. What I do, what Yannick is doing, we make screenshots from our gear, what we used before. And then afterwards we're going to test something out and every, everything is just back when we are done. Because Emios is just a one-time thing. So... Let's go into the run and you're gonna see what's happening. It is crazy. Most of the time we are using A1s. And if you see that passive up there, B on a 1, you do your max HP hit. That's basically it. Nothing else, nothing too crazy. Just survive, use the glitch, the bug or whatever's going on on the boss that he does not do his healing skill and you should be okay. So the boss will attack us. What's gonna happen? You're gonna see because we have do we do have high blessing, high stats, and our region and immortal set. That's why we actually survive. And I was so so mind blown. Like, hey, you can actually do it, Yannick. You did it again. You came up with something super great, and I really appreciate it. Thank you, man. And also thank you for letting me be on the account to show our people out there that it's possible like that. And you don't need to have something else. Just use your G-Nut, and most of you do have a G-Nut, I assume. So passive was on a 1 again, and everything okay. We're just gonna quickly kill the boss, just, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I I love it, man. I, I just love it. It's getting better and better and better. Keep advancing the strategy, and if there is a G-Nut in the rotation, you know on now. Like, okay. I'm just gonna do it and maybe do a screenshot about your gear you use now because you maybe gonna do it later too so everything is just like it is before you just simply do it and yes <laughs> that's how the big pros do it they screenshot the the gear and later on they just change back to it <laughs> I got so many screenshots about gear on my computer you have no ideas <laughs> so paying attention to the one on the passive and gonna hit him again. The good thing is he is not in his damage form. So if you use the skill right here and you kill him and it will probably be a, a real kill and the boss is not gonna revive and stuff. And yeah, still amazed, to be honest, amazed. And for later on, that probably can be done with Eddie. Ooh, that was pretty close. That can be done with other champions, high blessings and stuff, just will take a little longer. Let's see if we can survive. I think we're gonna survive. It was really close, but I still do think even we get crits now. Yeah, our healing is really nice. <coughs> it's immortal and region. And yeah, let's smack him again. Smack, smack, smack. <laughs> it is also a full heal, his skill. That's why it is so crazy in here. Because the boss will always face a full healed g -nut for that attack and yeah, you saw it even if it double crits, it was really close. But also you can kind of skip the crit rate in my opinion if you are 
dying too often so you can skip the crit rate and then you just hit a little bit lower but you are safer or something just keep it in mind there are to be honest there are ways here to do it even faster even better but why change something when it already works and yeah <laughs> yannick man <laughs> why i thought my my champions that can auto revive and revive on that they're like the best and stuff and you came around again and showed me nah nah think outside the box even more <laughs> i love it <laughs> oh there was that soul weep it i think it was a little bit close i think he got like damage reduction as i think we can just smack him now just even we don't care about the one anymore just smack him <laughs> <laughs> nice i love it <laughs> we're gonna take a look at the stats because they are super important so we do have almost 80k hp 3800 900 defense 266 was that right oh i'm on the wrong champion <laughs> I'm still blown away, guys. <laughs> so now we talk about the real stats. I'm sorry, but we got 75k HP, 5,700 defense. Nice. <laughs> 252 uh, speed, but also keep in mind, you can reach those stats even more if you use a leader spot. So on the end, it's not like fixed fixed but yeah you kind of saw what happened and stuff so you can just yeah do it in your own way to see if it works and stuff and yeah we got 100 111 crit rate 136 crit damage so the crit damage is not really there to be honest it's almost like nothing but you saw it is hitting really hard so it is totally worth it but if you want to you can skip the crit rate and you can skip the crit damage and the run will take longer but if you are safe it is okay too but yeah we want the fast runs over here you know and crit rate and crit damage doesn't do anything good uh, not, not crit rate and crit damage i meant accuracy and resistance does not do anything good for you we got soul reap in here keep in mind if you have what's it called brimstone and if it triggers on the wrong situation it can kill your run so big tip is just lower your accuracy and you should be okay and if you land it just by being unlucky then it is how it is just restart the run and yeah try it again it is actually not hard you saw just like how quick it went and stuff and yeah the blessing about brimstone is it should be like low accuracy and stuff and the masteries again i maybe i didn't show you already but those are the masteries nothing too special you could go the defense route and even be more tankier so there are many many things you could do in here to just make your run super nice and i really do love it because most people have the gnut if you don't i'm sorry for you but we saw it in the fusion the gnut triple hitter maximum hp we all went for him and now he's coming back doing the really really great stuff for us and yeah <laughs> again yannick for letting me be on the account don't forget to Drop a like on the video, it's really important for me. Subscribe if you haven't done already, and yeah, <laughs> have a nice day.